Okay, I didn't really want to do this video, but I'm going to do it. Because every time I upload a video on um, YouTube, I have a little intro where I have a picture of me, you know, going through. And there's a music in it I took from, uh, from YouTube library. So every time I post a, a video that has that intro uh, video portion in it, there's uh, some, uh, I think, little dot something company. I forgot the name of it. It's claiming that I'm doing copyright. So throughout this video, I'm going to put the music where I got from YouTube. And I'm tired. I keep on, you know, disputing that it's not copyright. I didn't violate any copyright because I got the music from YouTube. YouTube put it out there saying we can use it. Uh, you know, so every time I post it, there's uh, an issue with it. And the other day, uh, they uh, reject two of those dispute uh, saying that why they keep on saying that I copyright uh, the music when it's from YouTube. So they, um, for some reason, YouTube uh, reject the dispute. So because of that, I'm going to put that video, I'm creating this video throughout the whole video of this video, I'm going to put the music in the background and I want to know why YouTube is not doing anything about it. If it's copyrighted, YouTube needs to remove it from its library. So let me go on my computer and show you guys. And then they put my dispute was not approved. Okay. And I'm going to show you guys what music they're talking about. And there's this, which one? There was another one. There's this one. Again, dispute was not approved. And then while I was at the gym, I was uploading this. This was, uh, that's abs and cardio week. That was last week, I uh, think. And it says it include copyrighted content. Let's see what the con uh, copyright content is. I bet you it's the intro again. So here it says from 151 to 220, whatever. Let's see. Oops. Just pay attention to the music. Okay, there it stopped at 222, right there. All right, so they're saying here, uh, let me go back to the other ones that they claim is copyrighted also. Same thing. And this one, uh, they disapprove my uh, dispute and there's some penalties if I appeal the rejection and I send them a letter instead because if they dispute that uh, they reject this most likely they're gonna reject that and then there's gonna be a strike on me so I sent YouTube a, a, a letter what same thing again from 1518 to 1551 but you guys got the point so here I'm gonna go to YouTube audio library let me open another window uh, what's the name of that guy of the music uh, let me pause this for a second the copyright issues have been so consistent with the same thing. I create this letter, so every time it pops up, I just copy and paste it to dispute it. So the name of the person who who wrote this is Open Night by Jason Farham, whatever. So let's look it up on YouTube uh, library. Where is it? Is it here? Music editor. Okay. So here I'm going to paste the name, Open Night, see, Open Night by Jason Furham. There it is. YouTube has it. There's no, this, you know, stipulation what to do uh, if you use that music. So here I'm going to play it.
I didn't use all of the music. Anyway, that, you guys get the point. So how could this be the same uh, as a copyright? Okay, let's hear it again from YouTube. See, this is an open night. This in front. And there's my thing. Let's play it again. And then my appeal was rejected. Okay, where is the copyright? I have no idea. So let me work on this video right now and I'm gonna put it up as soon as possible.